challenges that Katniss is facing in the second film? What's going through her mind? Well, her life is very different now. Um, she's, uh, she's struggling from post-traumatic stress from the games, and she's kind of has a new life where she never has to worry about food anymore. She never has to worry about, you know, she's living in Victor's village, and that kind of leaves her feeling kind of useless. In, a, in an odd way, she has to get, adapt to this new life, and also, um, you close for me? she's I'm now experienced something with Peta that they'll only understand each other in a, in a, in a strange way. And so, um, Gail, who she's known most of her life, who she's always um, felt understood certain parts of her, now really Peta kind of understands a part of her that that Gail never will. Um, so. okay. <laughs> Josh, can you talk about, I get the feeling that the uh, love triangle just gets more and more intense uh, in the second film. Yeah, it's, um, it's very complicated. You know, uh, Peta had such strong, has such strong feelings for Katniss, and, uh, and he expressed them to her, and then he felt that they were, you know, she felt the same way, and then he come, come to find that they were just, it was just an act. So now he has it to It was complicated. With... It was an act. <laughs> <laughs> we're not getting into this. <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah, so, so I mean, it, it's, it's very complicated for Peter to kind of figure out what he's supposed to do now that he has his feelings and they're not being felt by her at the same time, but he still wants to help her and protect her and it's just a very complicated world they live in now. Yeah. And Liam, for you, obviously, when I was reading the book, I just remember reading the scene, the, the torture scene, basically. I would imagine that must have been one of the things that you were kind of most nervous or excited or feeling challenged about. That's a that's a crazy scene I would imagine to film. Yeah, it's uh, 